I am BCC. I am BCC. I am BCC. I am BCC. And I am assertive. I am BCC and I am God fearing. I am BCC. I am BCC. I am BCC. I am poor but deserving student. I am BCC and I am optimistic. I am BCC. I am BCC. I am BCC. And I am determined to finish my studies, no matter how hard it is. I was not dreaming to be enrolled in BCC. I took exam in AUP and luckily I did not pass. <laughs> and, um, so I decided to stop um, schooling for one year. But after a year, I realized whatever school you enter, it really depends upon you if you're going to learn or not at all. Um, BCC offer a course, different courses which um, really help us um, to motivate ourselves to make uh, to mold our uh, our personality to be a better person um, and uh, for three years now I'm studying here well I can all I can say is that I made the right choice um, I may not have follow what I really dreamed way back in high school life that to be an engineer but uh, still I think I mean I made the right choice of enrolling here as an education student um, right now, I can say that I was really um, molded into a better person and as productive as should be, um, as, as expected by, by the people that really um, uh, supports me on the things that uh, what I do. Now, without BCC, I cannot see myself uh, prospering. Uh, I mean, I cannot see myself still studying in college. Uh, maybe I could. I will be right there calling some passengers to ride the jeep, or maybe working at the farm of our, you know, since farm of uh, we called it the um, or the farm owned by other persons or the haciendas. So maybe that's my life. Are your friends Ryan Mascarinas, Divine Comedia, and we are so glad to turn around our campus today. So join, join us. us. Let's proceed to the garage. Let's go, Divine. Hi guys. Hello. Hello. As you can see, it's our garage. Yes. 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 And one thing's peculiar about this place because this serves as our garage, and at the same time, this serves as our classroom. That's it. And that was the start of the change in our lives when uh, we were really in you know, a very, uh, you know, we are in the deep quagmire of poverty. We're in, uh, it, it, is, uh, it is not easy for us to eat three times a, me uh, three times a, day. a day. And uh, <laughs> sometimes when we need to go to school without any penny in our pocket and I, uh, sometimes I need to borrow from my classmates, from my fellow uh, from my fellow students just just to have a fair going and to and from school. So Ryan, where are we now? Okay, so Divine actually we are right now at our mini library. Yes, mini library. Because most of the um, materials here are um, books which were donated by the city government, but they are few in numbers. Mm -hmm. And but the students of the Cal City College enjoy scanning their notes here uh, when they prepare before the exams. Okay, let's try to find out why Ryan College is a mini library. <laughs> You can see guys, here is our library. Mr. Barry, And here are 
the shelves that we put all our books. As you can see, it's so small. All of the books which you can see here are all uh, education, educational books and uh, here are compiled numbers of newspapers, right? Yes. We actually have this one for our students to be updated to all the current events that are happening in our world or in your local environment today. You are a student study. Before, when I gra graduate high school, I never thought or I ignored the fact that I could continue uh, studying until college. Because in in the six children of my parents and all are studying, how could you ever think in a poor family to enroll your child in, in a university or a college? So I never, I never thought of Choosing a course to take up uh, that was uh, my classmates were sharing what course they will take uh, after graduating high school. But I don't mind because I am very sure that I can uh, continue my college. So now at this point, me and Divine are heading towards the uh, newly built room and which is the new site for our uh, new computer lab. So guys, stay, be with us. Let's check out the room, look at what the feature it has to offer then. Yes, let's have let's, a look. Okay, so let's go. By the way, here is our Peace Corps volunteer, Mr. Justin Taylor. Hello. So this is our new uh, classroom for our Media Resource Center. As you can see right now, it's full of desks. Uh, the students have been using the desks just sort of until this room is ready as a hangout spot. Um, on this wall here, it's totally blank right now, but uh, in coming months it will be a world map mural, so the students will be able to see the world. And then over along this wall, uh, by Divine, you'll see um, that's where our 10 computer units are going to go. And then along the back, we'll have um, a sort of like a mini library in addition to what we already had. You probably already saw the small library. There will be more books. And then we'll also have um, a shelving unit over here where there'll be um, things like an LCD projector and a, um, a laptop for the students to use, all these sorts of things. Um, which is where we need your help to be able to donate some funds uh, the, in order to buy some of the smaller things like our new digital camera, our new printer that the students are really excited about. So any way that you can help is greatly appreciated. Thanks. Here in BCC, um, I found myself that I am this kind of person. Um, because... Uh, <laughs> Um, I promise that if I will be uh, enrolled at, in college, um, I will never expect any amount from my parents. Yes. Um, I promise that if I will study, I will do it for my own, with my own, with my own hardship and with my own effort with my own money also. Then I tried to um, graduate from high school um, as a working student. Um, I tried my best, I tried my best to finish my high school. Then um, after high school, then my, um, my last employ employer, uh, Miss Evangelista, uh, told me that she cannot longer uh, she could not longer support my studies in college. Then that was the big problem that I I faced that time. It is because um, uh, I I thought that there's there's no uh, person or there's no 
there's no other person to to ask help. Uh, then then I then I go to Tesda. I try to uh, I try to apply their another uh, program to have that um, ladderized courses. Um, that um, that in just a few months um, with my staff, um, I I will be able to find a um, job or it's just a simple work that will, that can help me. Then um, my my classmates or my best friends told me that. Um, she uh, she had that idea that um, if I will try to to take an exam here uh, at BCC, um, it would be a big opportunity for me to to study with uh, a lower tuition. Then I then I pursue then I pursue to it. Of what she have, uh, told me that then I took the entrance exam. Um, luckily, and luckily, with God's grace, uh, I I passed the exam. My idea is that um, I should just I just finished my first semester. Then, um, if I will stop uh, studying, at least I have that credential that I have been uh, enrolled in college, just for me to have um, any growth that um, or oh, any sure. uh, yes or shall we say. Um, Undergrad yes, undergrad college, or um, I have that certification for me to have some works to be qualified also to other uh, works. Then um, I I found myself that I really enjoy studying here in BCC because I found a lot of friends, a lot a lot of supporters. Yeah. <laughs> College and I should finish this. And now I'm I'm still in uh, second year. I'm still second year. Um, I should say that uh, I can say that now uh, with with my one and a half years in staying here at the CC, um, uh, there's a lot of realization that happens in my life. So, and then, but still, um, uh, being a working student, um, as uh, as you all know, I am a working student. I am the one who supports my study, and and since I am working student, it is not uh, it is not easy for me to uh, to send myself here in the CC. But still, um, uh, as what I've said, uh, there are a lot uh, of supporters that that really uh, uh, encouraged me that to to not to stop, not to stop, because. Um, Never say never. Um, never say never. Never say quit. Never say quit. Since uh, there's a lot of supporters, uh, I I uh, I realized that um, uh, life must go on. Yes. 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 Uh, that's a uh, busy scene. Okay, so this is Macaulay City College, but. Before we leave you, let me uh, let me have a short message from each one of us. Thank you for visiting Bacolod City College. Thank you for being here. Thank you for watching this video. I hope we touch your heart. I hope that through this you would learn something from us, and it would we would appreciate any help you could you could do for us. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for staying with us in a moment. Yeah, thank you also for supervising us and touring the Bacolod City College. Thank you so much. And lastly, um, uh, me and Divine, we would like to say thank you so much for having this opportunity to uh, be with you in a short uh, moment. And uh, all of us here are uh, proud to say that we, we are, are proud to be a BCCI!